Can everyone remember a simpler time? A time where you would run downstairs in your PJs to do the only thing worth doing before nine on a Saturday morning, watch cartoons. Such classics such as the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Batman the Animated Series, and Tom and Jerry. It was a tradition that every kid knew of. But now, if you turn on ABC, Fox, NBC, early on a Saturday morning, you don't get the fun children's TV. You, you have shows shoving the ABCs down your throat. It might not seem like that long ago, but the CW has been the only network showing cartoons for the past 10 years until October of 2014. Educational programming has taken Saturday morning cartoons and has demolished the and has demolished the beloved tradition. In the 1990s, the FCC was looking for a way to educate kids through TV. With this general idea in mind, they had the Children's Television Act, making it mandatory for a three hours of TV uh, a week on any network. The big companies that hosted the old cart the, o the old com s companies that hosted the Saturday morning cartoons such as Fox, ABC, CBS no longer show them. And the first to drop was NBC in 1992, CBS in 2000, ABC in 2004, and the last one holding out CW in late 2014. Although even with the new law for a few years, people argued a show such as The Flintstones was educational as it teaches ch children about history. The first sentence to describe the show, according to TV.com, is The Flintstones was a parody on, of modern life. A parody is a show that ma uh, makes fun of something purely for entertainment value and not that for educational t uh, purposes. But the law got rid of shows such as Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, which educated kids through an end, se an end segment called Turtle Tips. Wh wh if a law looking to educate children allows a parody show and not a show that actually looks to educate children, wh what's the point of the law? The also shows such as uh, that that were shows that are on the top ten, top one hundred list of top beloved children's show, uh, top ten hundred children's shows are shown in the nineteen eighties and nineties, not in the late two thousands when educational programming took over. The Press Gang, The Muppet Show, Bagpuss, Thundercats, and Transformers were the top five uh, children's TV show. Why don't we just take a look at the law? It is a disappointment to see that the tradition we, we grew up on is has been destroyed by a law that does not enhance any any entertainment value and no educational value. Make make a new channel. Reevaluate the law. Do something to fix this mess.